As you said, three people on that plane, all three of them did not survive this crash. The crash scene just behind me, we are not showing you a close-up shot of that scene right now because they are removing the bodies from the plane. Let's go to some video we shot just a short time ago of the crash site. As we said, this is in Munson Park, not far from Custer Airport, uh, which is here in Monroe. According to information we've gotten from sources, two of the three people on board were from Toledo. The pilot was from Monroe. We don't have identification yet on the three people, but the good news is the pilot was able to avoid hitting houses and people. There were people in this park. A high school a tennis team was practicing in the park here when this happened, and they were not far from the crash site. Also, there's homes just about 150 feet away. As I mentioned, a witness from that tennis team saw the whole thing go down. Go oh, outside. And I pointed at it and I was like, look, it's doing a trick for us. And he came around to the outer part of the, <laughs> to the outer part of the court. <laughs> he started coming back. He just started he just crashed. It was it's like you see in the movies where it's just the funnel and then the cloud and <laughs> It was obvious that he was trying to avoid us, and it's a sight I'll never forget. According to the flight plan for the plane, they left this morning from Lambertville, an airport there called Toledo Suburban. They then went to Pennsylvania and then were possibly supposed to land here at Custer Airport, not far from this park, at about 4 o'clock this afternoon. We're not sure exactly why the plane went down. According to one published report, there was engine trouble. As far as we know, the plane was a Piper Malibu Mirage, a single engine plane, and it is registered to Triple F Aviation LLC here in Monroe. Why they were on this flight, we don't know. We'll be continuing to gather information as we get it. Stay tuned. Reporting live in Monroe, I'm Tom Way, Channel 7 Action News. Tom, thank you very much. Emotional, heart-wrenching uh, words, certainly, from uh, that young witness who was there when that plane went down. And as uh, Tom mentioned, uh, that was a single-engine uh, Piper made in 2006. That uh, aircraft registered under the name Triple F Aviation LLC. The plane can carry up to six passengers. There are only 53 of these planes licensed to fly in the, U in the U.S., we're told. And again, uh, at this point, three victims uh, on that plane that crashed this afternoon in Monroe.